back into your edge, your big moment. Even more seconds, even more there. My name's John Locke. I'm director of bands at UNCG and also the director of the summer music camp. Do you know, I've, I've spent a lifetime in this auditorium. Uh, I remember being brought in this back door to look at the auditorium when I was here in March of 1982 to interview for the job. And this was, that was way before this renovation that brought these uh, nice, beautiful, wider seats and and better lighting and better air conditioning and heating to this place. So, but I've, you know, I've spent weeks and months and years of my life uh, in the auditorium. Once upon a time, the Acock Auditorium and now the UNCG Auditorium. I've been here pretty much forever. And I, I think that um, I've had some fantastic musical experiences uh, standing on the podium, directing the wind ensemble, conducting the wind ensemble over the years. And I know I've had a few moments that on the, standing on the podium when I thought to myself, you know, this is what I was put on earth to do. I was put on earth to conduct a college band. And I can remember many times standing here when it was going well, and it went well many times. It didn't always go great, but it went well most of the time. And I, but when it was really going well, I'm thinking to myself, this is like uh, Maslow, self-actualized man. I'm, I've, I've hit that level where you know down deep that this is what you're supposed to be doing with your life and that everything felt right and it was just all just very, very rewarding. Our music camp would not be possible. It would never have begun without John Locke's exceptional leadership and stewardship. It's really been his mission here at UNCG to build the school and build the camp over all of these years, starting at the very beginning with a small mailing that he did himself uh, with sort of a loan of the initial money to the operation we have now with well over 2,000 students enrolled each summer, five dorms full of our students and so many ensembles and offerings. Goal number one is we're here for music. I have a lot of people that, that bump into me or email me or talk to me and they say, well, tell me how are the band camps going, John? And I say, well, wait a minute. We don't have a band camp. We have a music camp. I've lived a lifetime in this hall and it means the world to me and uh, it's just hard to imagine my life without this old auditorium in it.